Wednesday sees the return of Group John McEnroe and all eyes are once again on Andy Murray. After a Novak Djokovic win on day three, the world number one would be looking to continue to keep pace in the fight for the year-end top spot. Standing in Murray's way though would be Kei Nishikori, who had not only beaten the Scot at the US Open this year, but also the Japanese number one's only other win over Murray had come here at the O2 two years ago. An opening set full of quality was punctuated by a thrilling tiebreak in which the Japanese number one edged ahead, setting up three set points. Superb! Then having saved two of those on the Nishikori serve, the top seed was at the peak of his powers to level the scores. Oh, you've got to be kidding me! Andy Murray had absolutely no business winning that point. But rather than get disheartened, the fifth seed recovered to once again pull ahead. Fabulous tennis. A break apiece early in the second meant another close run thing, but Murray was giving his all to avoid a further tie break. Well, he's falling in love with the drop shot. That's dangerous, especially against the likes of Murray. In the most fiercely contested match of the tournament so far, there was so little to choose between the two that scraps of luck could make all the difference. Well, slightly fortunate there, Murray, but Nishikori's only got himself to blame. Murray then pulled ahead to a double break lead, but that meant Nishikori could throw caution to the wind as he was battling to stay alive in this match. Oh yes, nothing wrong with that. The fifth seed salvaged one break, but Murray made no mistake with his second bite of the cherry. The Scots coming through the longest three-set match in World Tour Finals history. It's the first time since 2008 at these championships that Murray has managed to win his first two matches in group stages. And Murray gets it done despite dropping the opening set. A winner today in three, six, four in the third. Paris champions Henry Continen and John Piers continued their winning run by seeing off Rajiv Ram and Raven Klaassen in straight sets, which meant barring a Herbert Mahu straight sets win in the evening session, the fifth seeds would be through to the semi-finals.